Okay, today we will do an experiment to find out the color change of the pH indicators. So this is sodium hydroxide solution at a very low concentration, about 0 0.1 molar concentration. And this is the pH indicators. And we will put and we will put the pH indicators into the diluted sodium hydroxide solution. Then we will try to put some dry ice into it and see what happens there. Okay. So let's start the experiment. Okay, we use a gas rock to make sure that it is full of the full of the pH indicators. Then we put some dry ice there. Let's see the color change. Okay, as you can see, the solution becomes pale becomes not purple anymore. It now changed to something like green in color. Because the carbon dioxide goes in and then it dissolves in water to form carbonic acid. The carbonic acid H2CO3 then reacts with sodium hydroxide during a neutralization process. And now you can see it is green in color because it becomes neutral solutions. Okay, as you can see, it becomes power in colors, in green, uh, power green colors, and actually it tries to change to yellow colors because all of the sodium hydroxide has been reacted, has been neutralized by the carbonic acid form. Carbon dioxide keeps coming out from the dry ice through sublimations, and it dissolves in the in the solutions to form carbonic acid continuously and it makes the solution becoming yellow in color because it is slightly acidic you can try to put more dry ice into it And let's see what happens. Okay, now the solution becomes green in color and will not be changed to red in color because H2CO3 carbonic acid is only slight, it's only a weak acid, which is a, which is about. 5.7 in uh, pH. So in this experiment, we demonstrate the color change of uh, the color change of the pH indicators. We have sodium hydroxide at first, and then it is purple in colors. So if we put the dry ice into it, actually the dry ice will dissolve in uh, with sublime to give out carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide dissolved in water, becoming carbonic acid, reacting with the sodium hydroxide and and do neutralizations there. After that, it changed to 
it changed to yellow in color because it is about it is slightly acidic. So that's the end for this experiment.